TTC. What's up? Let's give it to it. Now, New York football giants, the super giants. No, I'm just joking. I don't think super giants will actually make sense because that's ours. We're the super chargers. So, anyway, the New York football giants, man. The most hated team probably in the NFC East. Actually, yeah. Uh, it's between them and the Cowboys. But anyway, man, it ain't about them, man. So, the New York football giants, man. The guy's got a two-time Super Bowl champion, Eli Manning. And I give him that. He's he's all right. He's decent, you know. But he he's just not a regular season football player. He's a playoff. Um, he just happened to make have miraculous things happen in the playoffs. You guys are a playoff team, you know. I'm not hating on the Giants since you guys have more success than us as far as Super Bowls and everything. But you know it is. You guys have the right to brag for that. You know what I'm saying? If I was the Chargers fan, I would brag for that too. But you know, it's just. You guys haven't won in since, what, I think 11, 2011, something like that around there. So, but anyway, man, like, I'm not scared of this team. You guys are obviously struggling this year. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be a good game. We're struggling too, but we both got the same record. But I think I think we got a chance. We got a shot at this. All we have to do, man, we, like I said, this, in the past, man, in our past few games, all we've been doing, just the way we've been losing games is just atrocious, man. It's just... It's just it's just terrible. It really is because we're losing close games. It's that we can't finish games in the fourth quarter. We turn over the ball late. Or during the game, we turn over the ball. You know what I'm saying? Like in, in the third or the fourth quarter, you know, we always turn over the ball and give different teams a shot in the closing the game and making us impossible for us to win. And our defense, is, it just only can do so much. It's like when our defense do really good, offense can't do anything. Offense do really good. The defense just give up so many points. It's it's really frustrating with the Chargers organization right now, man. But I know we got a lot of injuries, but we can bounce back. We can go nine and seven. It starts with the New York Football Giants. We can beat this team. I know we can. This team that the Giants been struggling for for a while too, man. Worse than us, man. Start off zero six. Now you guys won four straight and lost again and one to one. You know so. You guys are five and seven, same record as us. I'm not scared. I'm um I'm, I'm predicting it's gonna be a good game. We at you we at our house, we at home. You guys gotta travel, so all the way to San Diego, man. It's gonna be hard for y'all, man, because I mean we 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 still bitter from that loss, man. And Eric Weddle, man, this defense, Monte Tail, we need some leaders, man. I can't wait till Melvin Ingram comes back. Uh I want us to activate Laval Hawkins too. But but for the most part, you guys got to watch out for my boy, Keenan Allen, man. I know he had a few drops, man. Keenan Allen, man, just keep your head up, man. We're going to get this win. Get this win for San Diego, man. Let's beat these Giants, man. I'll be really satisfied, man. We got to beat them, man. You know, they, I mean, I, they not really a big threat. They they really ir irrelevant. Have no chance making to the playoffs in any way. So, but anyway, man, it's just, we got to do this. We got to take care of our shit, man. Limit these turnovers. Tony Gates, man, you got to get your head in the game, too, man. Future Hall of Famer in the tight end. Come on, man. Phillip Rivers, man, no picks, bro. Do your shit, man. I know you can. I know you have tough losses, but all that shit is in the past. We're looking forward, man. We're looking forward to the positive things. Things are going to happen. Mike McCoy, man, uh, get these men ready. Get these men ready. I'm looking for Richard Marshall to have a big impact on this defense. Like I said, on offense, my boy Allen, Gates, fucking Rivers, Danny Woodhead, please use him more. You know, hopefully Eddie Royal will come back, and so you'll be active to today. And Ryan Matthews, man, you know, this one will have a great game. And it just destroyed their offensive, destroyed our, our defensive line, man, and the Giants. And the Giants' offensive line is terrible, man. You like may have been sacked so many times, and their defense is, like, equivalent to ours in a way, you know. So I think this is going to be a high-scoring game, but I think we're going to win in an after effect. I, I can predict the score probably 38 I don't know, 38-30, some, some shit around there, man. But, uh, man, we struggling right now, but I still believe in my Bulls team that we going to come out and get a victory. I ain't showing my face in this freaking camp because the Giants fans don't deserve to see my face right now, man. They they don't. They really don't need it to see my face, man. So these Bones, uh, Bones NYG, I think, I don't know, all these other motherfucking New York Giants fan, man. So don't get your panties in a bunch. I'm like, nigga, why you didn't show your face? I mean, nigga, because I don't want to. Free country. And um, I don't think the Giants are a worthy team for me to show my face on cam. So that's why. You guys take care, man. Deuces. Charges all day, nigga. Charges all day. We get this, Rivers. Please get this win. I'll be damned if you lose against the New York Giants. I will be. I mean, I'm already down that we lost against the Redskins and this trash-ass Bengals team and the Dolphins. And 
man, I, I can go on and on, man. So, like I said, man, let's beat these giants. Let's beat these super giants, whatever, man. Deuces.